and welcome back. This is Island Living episode four. Heck yeah. Look, I'm really enjoying this pack so far. So <laughs> yeah, um, it's raining, which is pretty cool. Um, I like how all the raining effects look beautiful in the water, which would have been like a real pain to animate, I can imagine. So I appreciate that. Good job, EA. Also, why is this water all icky? Hmm? Hmm, very interesting. Also, that's really cool that the birds like land like that, but that that's kind of fun. But anyways, um, <laughs> it's bright and early today and I don't know. <clears throat> Set with bait. I don't know. Set trap. Let's see what's going on. I want to see what this is. But yeah, I don't know. I haven't played with these yet, so we'll have to see what we can catch. So, you know, good times. Check trap. Ooh. Okay, so this is one you can work from home at, which is pretty cool. Ooh, I'll explore the cave or plant something. Well, and plant something. That's kind of fun. Well, let's plant our pineapple, I guess. <clears throat> Live dangerously, right? It's raining, so I don't think we need to water it, which is kind of fun. Well, that's a pretty easy job today. Nice. Ooh, it must be getting time to spooky day. But anyways, uh, let's go and look at the things. How are you guys doing? Look, I just, I love looking at this world. I'm sorry. We're going to go to that cave though on the volcano, which I really don't want to go to because we got tentacled last time. Maybe we won't get tentacled this time. I'm assuming this is, yeah, this is the island we need to go to. <clears throat> I'm also thinking I was going to build here, but it looks very, like, I like this lot, but I kind of want to live here. I might not play with the off the grid trait, but we will see. We will see. We might. We might try it out for a little while and then turn it off. But, you know, for now, I think we'll just stay in our little starter. I think once we start, like, maybe having kids or something or get a girlfriend or a boyfriend and want to move, we'll do that. But for now... For now, we shall stick to what we're up to. <laughs> so I'm going to save before we go in here because I really don't want to die. So that's the thing. What do we need to do? Explore the cave. Oh, golly gosh. Here we go. <laughs> Please don't kill me. I really don't want to die. We didn't die. <laughs> Trekking through the island's cavern, Archie spotted a large pile of debris and seashells. He, with a little pause, he rummaged through and collected objects with the perfect souvenirs for his adventure. With his prize in hand, he continued on his way. Okay. What did we get? <clears throat> a sea urchin shell. That's kind of fun. Let's uh, clean up some trash while we're here because, like, I don't know. <clears throat> Live dangerously, right? Although it feels like there's lots of trash. Let's do our part, I suppose. Clean up some trash, which is a good idea. I don't know. Clean up. I don't want to spend all day cleaning up, so I'm, I don't know. Can you hold like a clean up beach party or something? Because I remember seeing everyone clean up trash in the trailer. So let's go here now. <clears throat> We've done a pretty good job. We've cleaned up some trash. There's still some trash around, but, you know, we're doing better. So I want to see, take a sample from the ocean. I want to see what this is and ooh, let's harvest a pineapple as well while we're here. Please tell me you're not swimming your way over here because I remember you swam last time. I'm like, buddy, you're killing me. <clears throat> yes, we got our pineapples back. Take a sample, please. I love this waiting. I think it's very cool. Analyze sample. Let's see how this goes, my friend. I did cheat his logic skill. Ooh, what did you find out, my friend? Research data. Send to the reaches. Send it? <clears throat> okay. Send the analyst to gain job performance or sell it for a bit of side profit. Oh my goodness. So I'm assuming the nature channel gets it all like, you know, 
<laughs> oh, that's funny. I like that. That's kind of cool. Let's just go around and like see what we can find like conserving the island and stuff. So I'm assuming the sample's going to tell me it's kind of toxic because uh, it's green. <laughs> if I had to guess, you know, just just a guess. I don't know. Algae bloom. Okay. Ah, huh, that's kind of fun. So that must be why it's green. It might not be toxic, but it's, well, I mean, algae is not great. Okay. <clears throat> After careful observation, Archie has discovered the invasive species invested to a plant. Spray the object to keep it under control. Spray invasive species. Oh, that's cool. We can do that. Ah, look at me go. That's kind of fun. I don't know. <laughs> We're saving nature or whatever, you know. Doing our thing. Can't believe people would leave rubbish on the beach. It's so rude. <laughs> oh, look. Did you, oh, he just changed into scuba gear. I don't think he, um, he mermaided it up. But let's go here and maybe, yeah, clean that up. Me, I'm like, I'm not going to clean up trash all day. Cleans up trash all day. <laughs> Look, I'm trying my best. But I just, I don't know how to tell if, um, like, I don't know. I wish we had a friend that we could do this with. What is wrong with you? Cramp from swimming. My poor boy. You'll be fine, buddy. Power through. <laughs> I wish there was like an easier way to do it. I don't know, because the swimming's a little bit slow. That's okay, I guess. I mean, I guess we can jet ski and stuff, but I don't know. I want to go out here and see like what this is. Like, I feel like if it's coming off the volcano, it's probably not a great thing, but that's okay. I don't know. Clean up. Clean up. I don't know if this is like lava or if this is like trash. I think it might be lava. But I feel like we should clean it up anyways. I don't know. <laughs> I wonder too if you can like get struck by lightning while in the water. Because like, I don't know. What are you doing? Look at him with his umbrella. Buddy, you're fine. You don't need an umbrella. Put it away, my friend. He's killing me. <laughs> uh, okay, stop it. Oh my god. Look at him go with his umbrella. You're a goober. Oh my goodness. Look at him go. <laughs> what an idiot. Oh man. Okay, let's go somewhere else because like we're getting rained on. We've done an okay job at this sort of stuff. I want to... Oh, she's not here. Dang it. I wanted to go meet her. Let's head to the bar, I guess. <clears throat> it's not actually very many community lots. Actually, there's only one community lot here. Which is a bar. I suppose that's kind of accurate to how <laughs> beach towns are. We've pretty much just got bars here. I don't know. I mean, we have a bowling alley too. Yeah. I don't know. But you feel like there'd be a little bit more. But I guess not. That's okay. <laughs> oh, love it. Happy hour. Yes, please, my friend. Order drink. Can I order a happy hour drink? Thank you. What are we getting? Let's get ourselves a dim and gusty. I think that might be our favorite, but who knows? Hack to the yeah. Hello, friends. Is this lady our friend? We don't know her yet, but we're gonna know her. How are you doing? <laughs> oh, look at that! There's like a tip jar. That's that's cute. Did you know in Australia, tips aren't really a thing? Like. We pay our weight stuff. <laughs> Just like a heads up, you know. Because um, I know in the States and some countries that have like tipping, you guys don't pay weight stuff very well because they rely on tips. But in Australia, no one really gives tips. And people just like get the money they need like from their wages. Which is an interesting thing if you're, you know. I don't know. I find people's cultures are very different. Which I suppose, I mean, it, it's fair. Look at him go. I like that he gets all this conservation stuff, which is kind of cute. Oh gosh, he really needs to pee. 
So maybe you should stop talking and we'll go to the bathroom, my friend. I didn't get to find that mermaid I wanted to be friends with, which is kind of sad, but that's okay, I guess. Oh well. Um, order food. What do we want for dinner? Uh, actually, I think I've got rotten hot dogs in my inventory. Yeah, I do. <laughs> we'll put that in the trash. Um, order food. Do we want to order food? Eh? Actually, I think we might go home and buy a barbecue and then have a barbecue for dinner because I don't know it, it counts towards my aspiration and I'm here for that because like I don't know I want to complete the aspiration because like I don't know I didn't actually complete the aspirations in Get Famous like in my let's play so I want to work hard on that this time so a thousand bucks you think I'm come some kind of rich person it's funny because I am actually kind of rich <laughs> oh, I love it, but I want a barbecue. Do you hear that cast music? Is that new? That has to be new. That's so cool. Is this like a... Yeah, I'll put one of these down. I want a barbecue. I'm going to put my pineapple over here. That's fun. And I think we'll use maybe this one. Cute. We'll put that there. Love it. I kind of want to use this, but I think we'll just stick to this for now. Make some grilled fruit. Oh, and I want to send this to the research center too. Probably should have done that when I was promoted, but that's fine. Yes. Okay. Um, where's your fruit? No, seriously, where's your fruit, buddy? Oh, here we go. I'm just blind. Apparently, that's okay. We'll put that in our fridge. Now we've got actual food instead of having to cook every time. Also, look how cute this is. I just, oh, I love it. This world is beautiful. And I really like how, one, I like this balloon. I just want to point that out there, that I really like the balloon. I think it's super dumb looking. And it's, yeah, I love it. It comes in fish colors too. But I just think it's really fun. <laughs> Very nice. Very nice indeed. So I guess you can go to sleep and what do we think? Power through, do another day? Mm. Yeah, I think we should. <laughs> I think we should. Ooh, what's going on in our little trap? It's wobbling around. I don't know why it's doing that. I'm gonna check it. Ooh, look at this. Our needs are great. <laughs> Look, I'm not here for that. Okay, we'll feed him sometimes, but you know. Okay. That's fine. I also appreciate that he's still actually tanned. Like, how long has he been tanned for? Like, two or three episodes now? That's kind of fun. Um, so, what are we thinking? What else do we have to do? We need to find things beachcombing. So let's, I don't know, go... Search for some shells, maybe. I wonder if that counts. Oh, are you sick, my friend? I'm sorry. Um, order. Where is this? Medicine. Perfect. I actually don't want to celebrate Spooky Day, though. So I'm just going to say no. Goodbye. <laughs> Not really interested in that today. Sorry, my friend. Um... Beachcomb for seashells. Let's see if we can find some seashells. Seagull snatched it. Oh my goodness. That's funny. Oh, I like that. Oh, he's doing these things still. Oh, well, that's cool. So we can just like keep on beachcombing and he does his thing. Work from home. <clears throat> Archie is being promoted to wildlife technician. He now makes an extra $12 an hour. He also has received the following bonus. Write conservation article. <clears throat> so we can write co conservation article. We need to do one. And we need to get some samples from the volcano island. So we'll write an article first while we're here. 
Can you not use this? Is it because of this thing here? I'll get rid of it then. Goodbye. Sorry, new vase. How do you guys feel about the new build mode? I'm digging it. I really like all the new stuff. I think it's very, very nice. I I really like it. I like all the... Um, <clears throat> I think it's great that we've got matching wood tones. Um, I don't particularly mind, but I know a lot of people mind. And I also really like the style. I like tropical kind of things. So this is really my aesthetic. So I'm really digging it. And I also, I really love these cabinets. I think they're very cool. I think that, I don't know, they're just like really modern and stuff. And I don't know, I really appreciate them. They look very nice. I don't know. I like them. I don't know if they're modern or, but I just really like that style. I don't know what it is. So that's kind of fun. <clears throat> but yeah, I don't know. We'll write our little article. And then I think, well, I mean, obviously we've got to go to the thing and like get some samples. But I think I want to go try to meet that girl I placed down the other day, um, which we haven't met yet. Although she might not be at home. So that's a thing. Ooh, welcome wagon. Oh, hello, friends. I'll finish my, I want to finish my article, but I want to meet my friends. Also, the sim, I believe, is meant to be trans, which is pretty cool that they've included a trans townie, because I'm, I'm down for that. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm, I like when they do inclusive things like that. I think it's very nice. So that's kind of fun. I don't know. I think it's, it's just nice to see the representation of all different. You get off my laptop. You're like getting out of my house now. I've had enough of this, okay? I would have liked to get to know you two better, but you got on my freaking um, thing. So, gotta say hard pass. That fish just swam through the coral. How do you get into first person mode, by the way? Because I forget what it was, but you can actually go into first person mode while looking at this. And I forget how to go into first person mode. So we'll have to try that. But that's fine. You guys can leave my house now. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye. I want to go try to... Oh, good. She's at home. So this is my sim. I don't know. I think she's pretty cute, but... I, I don't know. I kind of feel like Archie might date her. <laughs> Which is kind of funny because I'm like, yeah, I'll date your guys' sims. And then I'm like, ooh, but my sims real cute. I mean, not that your sims aren't cute, but anyways. Oh, it's our mom. Sorry, mom. Kind of busy. I don't know. I think she's real cute, though. I think she's real cute. I don't know. I kind of like the idea of him, like getting into a relationship and stuff and like you know just so that we can like have two sims in the household and also try out like some of the other new traits and obviously I made the sim a mermaid so um you know I I mean it'd be nice to try the mermaid stuff because like I feel like now's a good kind of time to try it out because like I mean obviously a lot of people are playing it but if you guys haven't like I don't know you might have wanted to try it and experience it yourself first before you actually like see someone else play it so I think it's kind of like I don't know kind of fun to be like okay well yeah I don't know that's just me to give you guys the opportunity to play it before we do that so that's the thing I don't know Ah, oh, that's fun. But yeah, she's kind of a pun. Her name's Mia Carl, but that's not the pun. She kind of... I've been playing a lot of Breath of the Wild. I bought a Switch the other week, and I've been loving it. And um, they've got a character in there, Mifa. And I was like, hey, look, it's a fish wifey. I'm like, oh, Mifa's a fish wifey. I'm like, she has to have red hair and be called Mia, because that sounds kind of like Mifa. And so she's kind of a pun. So <laughs> not really, but like, really? <laughs> I don't know. And I love this swimsuit. It's so cute. Ask if mermaid. Can I? I want to see. Mermaid, what gave you that idea? That's so funny. 
Oh, I love it. That's kind of fun. But yeah. I wanted to meet her. Let's watch her. Are you going to get your ta tail? Tail, please. Tail, please. Tail. 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 Do it. Mermaid up. She's not mermaiding. Rude. Rude. Wanted to see you turn into a mermaid. Whatever. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go and we're gonna get the um the samples from our waterfall friend. And we'll probably clean up because you, that's what we do when we're here. We're like, yep, see some trash, gotta get that. I don't know, look, I, I like picking stuff up. I d just, I don't know. I want to see how it works with conservation and stuff. I just, I don't know, I want to see how it goes. So that's what, that's what we're going to do. Take a sample. Yeah, we can have a shower over here too, which is kind of fun. <clears throat> kind of fun. So we just need to take three samples. We need to wait a while. Okay then, friend. Oh, you another conservationist? Hello. You look like it. Um, pro bump. That's funny. Let's do it. Yeah. So I think that's our co-worker. That's kind of cool. Oh, this must be another one of our co-workers. Oh, that's fun. We're all hanging out here. Take another sample while we're here. Come on. Yeah, you've got a good rap. That's nice. Um, Playing with. Yeah, let's all play in the waterfall. Good times, right? Good times. I love that we're all just like hanging out in the waterfall. It's like working. <laughs> He's like, really? You two a bunch of kids. <laughs> love it. Love it. Ouch, dangerous breeze. Yeah, you should be more careful when handling dangerous stuff. My goodness, Archie. You're out of control. Beach comb for seashells. Yeah, let's see if we can find any more shells. That's kind of fun. That's kind of fun. Love it. Did you find anything? No. Oh, well. So I think you should go and use the bathroom. And what are we going to do? <clears throat> oh, there's a coconut tree. That's kind of fun. I think we should... Perhaps, um, let me think. Let's look, let's take an odd job. I think we've got time to take an odd job. What's this? Meeting a celebrity. Our mom's a celebrity, so we don't really need to deal with that. So, <clears throat> oh, that's cool. Um, how do I do it again? Internet does not work off the grid. Oh, okay, because this lot here that we're on technically is off the grid. Oh, that's kind of funky. I guess that's another use for the laptops too, to be like, oh, okay, we're off the grid technically, so like we can go do that. That's kind of cool, I guess. I don't know. I guess we'll take, um... oh, look at this. Look at all these people like taking care of the island. That's cute. I don't see any trash around here, so that's pretty good. We must be getting better at this. Um, take sample from the ocean. Let's have a look. Let's see what's going on. <clears throat> Did you take your sample? Ooh, analyze sample. Yeah, analyze all these samples. Do your thing, my friend. <clears throat> you probably shouldn't do this in the ocean, but that's fine. Whatever, right? Oh, it's cute, cute scuba guy. How you doing, scuba man? I actually wonder if we can, like, go scuba diving. That, that's probably a thing we should have a look at. <clears throat> I am curious. Send to research center. Send to research center. That's actually pretty cool. We get a decent amount of money. 
and we actually got like heaps of way to that's an easy way to get promoted dang that's awesome that's very cool i like that that's like i don't know that's kind of cool because you can like keep on increasing your performance and stuff and like looking after nature and stuff like that i'm going to live dangerously and go in the cave again I don't know what we can find in this cave, but I want to find something fun. Preferably not a giant tentacle, but, you know, we'll see. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, we're very hungry. Okay, so exploring deep into the cave, Archie discovered an underground beach occupied by an ancient sea wreck. While exploring the wreckage, the rotted wood began to sway from the tidal waters coming in and out of the cove. Realizing this area would flood soon, Archie fled the rising waters and back into the cave's tunnels, leaving his discovery behind. Well, that's a shame. Oh, well. Um, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to end the episode and send my boy home and I might put him in some scuba gear as well in between episodes and we'll pick it up in the morning. I don't know. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you all next time. 